The 20-year-old known as the Barefoot Bandit could be close to making a plea deal with the federal government. That news came Thursday as Colton Harris Moore pleaded not guilty in a new indictment against him. Harris Moore's attorney says the deal is hung up over plans to sell the story of his two-year run from the law. For the hundred millionth time, we'll say he does not want to make a dime off of this. He thinks it's wrong. He doesn't think his family should make a dime off of it. And unfortunately, the, thing, the government thinks his lawyers shouldn't make anything out of it. Um, so if there's any money generated, it would go to the victims. Harris Moore is expected to owe $1.3 million in restitution for allegedly stealing cars, boats, and planes. I'm not going to talk about a specific figure, um, but it's a significant amount of money that we're talking about, and uh, it would be enough money to pay a great percentage of the restitution. In all, he's accused of 70 crimes. The new indictment adds bank burglary charges. Harris Moore was arrested in the Bahamas last year. He had become a sensation, even collecting fans on Facebook. Regardless of whether Colton cooperates or not, there is going to be a movie about Colton Harris Moore. There are going to be more books, sorry Jackson, about um, <laughs> Colton Harris Moore, but that's going to happen no matter what. So it's just a matter of whether he can generate some funds to pay the victims. Harris Moore's lawyer says the government is concerned that allowing him to sell a story would just generate more publicity. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.